Greetings, dear dreamers and wanderers from the enchanted glen of modern world news. Here in our magical realm, we sprinkle stardust on stories so captivating, they'd make even the moonbeam dance with delight. Imagine breathing in air so polluted, it's akin to smoking 50 cigarettes a day. This is the reality for millions around the world. Air pollution, an invisible killer, is on an alarming rise. It's not just an environmental issue, but a severe health risk. UNICEF's latest findings reveal the shocking extent of this crisis. Let's delve into the details. We're now joined by environmental scientists who've been studying this issue closely. Their insights are eye-opening. Air pollution isn't just about hazy skies. It's about toxic particles that infiltrate our lungs, blood, and even brains. Now, let's take a virtual tour of the world's most polluted cities. The visuals are startling. These cities are shrouded in smog, with air quality indices reaching hazardous levels. It's a public health emergency. But it's not just these cities. Air pollution affects us all, no matter where we live. We're now opening a poll. How often do you think about the air you breathe? Your answers might surprise you. The results are in. A majority of us don't think about it often enough. But it's time we did. Air pollution is linked to heart disease, lung cancer, stroke, and even mental health issues. Children are especially vulnerable. Their developing lungs and brains can be permanently damaged. But there's hope. We can turn the tide on air pollution. It starts with understanding our carbon footprint. Every choice we make, from the cars we drive to the energy we use, contributes to air pollution. But by making conscious choices, we can reduce our carbon footprint and help clean the air. Switch to renewable energy. Use public transportation. Plant trees. Every action counts. It's not just about saving the environment. It's about saving ourselves and our future generations. The fight against air pollution is a fight for our health, our children, and our planet. We urge you to join this fight. Share this video. Spread the word. Let's breathe life back into our air. Remember, the air we save today is the life we save tomorrow. Thank you for watching and for being a part of the solution. Oh my dears, come sit by me for a moment, will you? You see, when I was just a little girl, with ribbons in my hair and dreams as big as the sky, I'd sit by the radio, listening to the news. Oh, how I longed to be the voice that told stories, that connected people, that made a difference in the world. I pretend my little room was a grand new studio, and my dolls were my audience. Please, my dears, I beg you with all the earnestness of my fading days, comment and subscribe. Oh, my dears, come sit by me for a moment, will you? You see, when I was just a little girl, with ribbons in my hair and dreams as big as the sky, I'd sit by the radio, listening to the news. Oh, how I longed to be the voice that told stories, that connected people, that made a difference in the world. I pretend my little room was a grand new studio, and my dolls were my audience. Please, my dears, I beg you with all the earnestness of my fading days, comment and subscribe.